What's going on everybody? Welcome back to another predictions video. So, we're doing another one of these. We did the predictions videos for the rankings, the top 10 rankings for both the ATP and the WTA for next year. Go check that out if you haven't already because there's some interesting picks and also you submitted your picks in the comments of those videos, so go check those out. But we're gonna do who is gonna win the majors for next year. We're gonna start with the ATP. Who is gonna be the winner of Wimbledon? Of course, the Australian Open in February, Roland Garros, and the US Open. Who's going to win those events? And not only am I picking my picks, we're going with your picks as well because we put polls out on the channel and you guys voted. So these are the votes that you submitted and the most popular players who you think are going to win these events. But let's start with your pick or your choice for the Australian Open title. So the Men's Australian Open 2021 title, you guys picked, I guess, the best Australian Open player of all time, Novak Djokovic. So you guys picked Novak Djokovic to win the men's title. Good pick. Solid pick. He's the defending champ. He's won the title more, I think, than anybody else. Definitely any active players at the moment. But let's go with my pick now. So I'll pick something a little bit different. I've gone with Dominic Team. I think Dominic Team is going to win this event. He proved last year he was only one set away from winning the whole thing last year. And of course, he's got the US Open title now in his back pocket. So I'm going to go with Dominic Team. And now with Federer not playing as well, I think Team is the second best player at the Australian Open next year. Of course, behind Djokovic. But if Djokovic gets a little bit upset and maybe loses a match, it's Team's for the taking. So I'm going to go with Dominic Team to win the Australian Open 2021. You guys went Djokovic. I've gone with Team. Okay, let me know down below. Do you agree with the Team pick? Of course, he was the finalist of last year. It's not the craziest pick in the world. He has won a Grand Slam title as well. Okay, let's move on to the clay court season. Let's go to the Roland Garros predictions. You guys picked... You guys pick Rafa Nadal, and no surprise there. I mean, obviously, he's the overwhelming favorite to win that event. Maybe Dominic Team, maybe Novak Djokovic are second and third favorites, but Nadal, definitely the favorite, 13-time champion. He won this year. He's only lost a couple of matches at the event in his whole career, so definitely the solid pick. And now let's go to my pick. I've also gone Rafa Nadal. It's so hard to pick against Rafa at the French Open. Not many players have beaten him there. Like I said, only a couple of players have beaten him in the whole of history. He's won over 100 matches there as well. It's so hard to pick against Rafa. Like I said, maybe team, maybe Djokovic, you could pick them and make some arguments, but it's got to be Rafa to win it next year. You guys have picked it, and I've picked the same. So we're both going Rafa Nadal in that one. No surprise. I think anybody who doesn't pick Rafa Nadal has got some explaining to do because that is a tough argument to make against Rafa at the French Open. Let's go now to the Wimbledon title. Of course, we didn't get Wimbledon in 2020, so it's been, well, it'll be 24 months by the time we get to Wimbledon next year in 2021. So who knows who's gonna win it? Let's go through the predictions. So the Wimbledon men's prediction, you guys have gone with Novak Djokovic, defending champion, of course, beat Federer in that epic 2019 match, saving championship points. Came back to win. And now let's go through my picks. So I have also picked Novak Djokovic. And like I just said, it's so hard to make an argument for anybody else. Maybe Federer, maybe Rafa. But other than that, all the other guys in that top 10, they lost really early two years ago. And I know two years is a long time between tournaments. So again, we're going to have to probably wait until we get the grass season in July or June. Because maybe Zverev, maybe Medvedev. Maybe City Pass, maybe even Team, maybe those guys start playing well on the grass, but we don't know. It's been two years since we've seen a grass court match. It's very hard to pick against the world number one. Maybe Federer, maybe Nadal, but I'm going with Djokovic, and you guys have also gone with Djokovic. Okay, so again, we're both on the same page. The reasoning for that would be, well, he's the defending champion, world number one, and maybe Federer, maybe Nadal, but no one else has proven themselves at Wimbledon in that top 10. We don't know what, you know, Medvedev and City Pass and Zverev are really like at Wimbledon because they haven't done much there before. Let's go now to the US Open. So the US Open throws up random champions. We know that. Okay, so for the US Open champion of 2021, it's a long way away. So we're picking really, really early here. But you guys have picked 2019 champion Rafa Nadal, overwhelming favorite. There was an argument there for Djokovic. A lot of people were picking Djokovic, but Nadal definitely was the overwhelming favorite from you guys. So Nadal is your prediction, but like I said, random champions come out of the US Open and I've gone with a bit of a random champion. I'm gonna pick, I'm gonna pick Daniel Medvedev to win his first ever major and it's gonna be at the US Open now. He made the final in 2019, lost in five sets to Rafa. He made the semi-finals this year, lost to Dominic Team in a couple of close tiebreakers and he probably could have won the whole thing had he have won those tiebreaks and beaten Team. 
So I'm going to stick with Medvedev. I think Medvedev's going to make a breakthrough. A lot of people think Medvedev's got a chance at the Australian Open, but I think the Australian Open's a little bit too soon, especially with the guys like Djokovic and Nadal coming back to the hard courts. So I'm going to go with Medvedev at the end of the year. US Open throws up random champions, and I think we might get Medvedev winning that one. Well, you guys have picked Djokovic, Nadal, Djokovic, Nadal. So you guys definitely think that the big three are going to continue to dominate in 2021. I've gone a little bit different. I think it's going to be Dominic Team winning the US. I've gone a little bit different. I think that Dominic Team is going to win the Australian Open. I think that Nadal is going to win the French Open. That's a given. Wimbledon goes to Djokovic, and Medvedev is going to take the US Open. Let me know down in the comments below, who did you pick? Let me know, Australian Open, Roland Garros, Wimbledon, and the US Open. Who are your picks for the men's tournaments?